Gregory Hammond, Greg Olson, born April 20, 1945, is an American entrepreneur, engineer, and scientist who, in October 2005, became the third private citizen to make a self funded trip to the International Space Station with the company Space Adventures. Olson was the co founder and chairman of Sensors Unlimited Inc., a company developing optoelectronic devices such as sensitive near infrared and shortwave infrared cameras. One of Sensors Unlimited's major customers is NASA. Currently, Olson is president of Go Ventures, LLC, in Princeton, New Jersey, where he manages his angel investments, South African winery, Montana Ranch, and performs numerous speaking engagements to encourage children, especially minority and female children, to consider careers in science or engineering. He also is a physics professor at Ryder University. Topic. Early life and education Olson, born in Brooklyn, New York, was the son of an IBEW Local 3 electrician. His mother was a school teacher. He grew up in Bay Ridge and graduated from Ridgefield Park High School, Ridgefield Park, New Jersey in 1962. Olson initially wanted to be a baseball player but realized from local Little League how tough the standard was. Olson was inspired by his father to become an electrician, always having the education at home to fix things in house instead of calling a repairman. After being written off as a failure by teachers due to poor grades in high school, Olson planned to join the United States Army until he was counseled to try college for several months. Through an IBEW Local 3 scholarship, Olson attempted college, kept his grades high, and graduated magna cum laude with multiple degrees from Fairleigh Dickinson University. He later graduated with a Ph.D. in materials science from the University of Virginia. He had two daughters, Kim and Krista, and has six grandchildren, Justin Dibsey, Carter Dibsey, Danielle Dibsey, Romina Lapadula, Athena Lapadula, and Oriana Lapadula. Olson admits to little business training and believes that for companies making less than 100 million, the smaller companies as he calls them, that success is based more on intuition, instinct and hard work. He does credit his success to his graduate science training. Two of my startup companies are from the fields I trained in. For instance, my first company EPITAXX, a supplier of optical detectors and receivers for fiber optic telecommunications and cable television networks, relied on my knowledge of physics and material science. Olson likes to put his money into high risk startups. Olson founded EPITAXX, a fiber optic detector manufacturer, in 1984 together with Vladimir Ban. It was sold in 1990 for $12 million. He then founded Sensors Unlimited in 1992 with Dr. Marshall J. Cohen. Sensors was sold to Finazar Corp. for $600 million in 2000. It was then repurchased by the management team in 2002 for $6 million, and sold once more to Goodrich Corp. in 2005 for $60 million. Topic. Space flight details Having flown to the International Space Station ISS with Soyuz TMA-7 launched October 1, 2005, docked October 3 and landed with Soyuz TMA-6 October 10, Olsen is the third self-funded space tourist to visit the ISS, following Dennis Tito 2001 and Mark Shuttleworth 2002. All three space tourists flew through Space Adventures, Ltd. Olsen has made some comments indicating that he is unhappy with the Space tourist designation. The following is from National Geographic's coverage. Space launch, along for the ride, 2007. Greg, the term space tourist implies that you backquote LL write a check and you go for a joyride. And believe me, that is not the case at all. Narrator, Greg worked hard to get this far, training for two years with the Russian Space Agency. Olsen had to train for a year and a half before being ready to go into space. During a routine X-ray, a black spot was found on his lung. He had to have a monthly medical check to obtain permission to fly. 
It took nine months for him to pass the medical. He conducted several experiments in remote sensing and astronomy while aboard the space station. Dr. Olson is a licensed amateur radio radio operator holding FCC callsign KC20NX and spoke to students via ham radio from space through the ARIS project. In an informal presentation at a New Jersey high school, Dr. Olson estimated the price of his space excursion at $20 million. United States dollars. Topic. See also List of space travelers by name